At around 6.23 a.m., Gemma was caught leaving her home wearing a backpack and also pulling a very large suitcase behind her, a blue suitcase to be exact. The suitcase seemed very light and Gemma wasn't having any trouble pulling it. Gemma pulled that suitcase all throughout the streets of London, took it on public transport, and even slightly changed her appearance halfway through her journey. She removed her backpack and seemingly put it in the suitcase. She also put on a hat and a face mask. She arrived at Deborah's house around 8 a.m. and she was inside the house for about five hours. At around 1.13 p.m., Gemma was caught again on CCTV, leaving Deborah's house. Her clothes were different this time though. She was carrying a red and a blue bag, which she didn't have before. She was still carrying the suitcase, but something didn't seem quite right. Before, the suitcase looked empty. Gemma was pulling it with her, behind her with ease. It didn't seem like it was a struggle, but now it was kind of bulging at the seams. 